Hi, welcome. Okay, past favorite Deer Fest quotes. Go. The yarn puppet monstrosity. The stuffed moose and squirrels one. No, thank you. Those beef Hello, and nice. welcome to Coffee beans. World, voted Washington's best coffee themed amusement park. All of our attractions are family friendly and available to children of all ages, just like our coffee. So, take a sip of our own Deer Diner organic coffee and let the adventure begin! I can't get through this. Yeah, Anderson, I didn't want to say this in front of Wake, but are you sure this is a good idea, going on your own? Assuming we believe the page, I need to check this out. We need to find the cult. Anyone we meet here could be a member. And this scratch guy... The evil doppelganger? It must be true, or else this guy can't write for shit. The quality of his writing aside, if this page turns out to be true like the rest have, this could be a breakthrough. We might solve this thing before a backup even arrives. Yeah, but they're taking their time, so just be careful out there. Meanwhile, I think me and Wake will have a chat. Maybe I can shake something loose. Okay. But remember what happened with the salt shaker. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, real funny.
The page placed me in a trailer, somewhere in Watery. I should ask around. A vote for Mayor Setter is a vote for everyone. For Watery! Hey, where is the time gone? There's just a wretched husk of what used to be me left. Watery's definitely quaint. Good day. I bet they have good fish here. What have you been up to this time around? There's only so many times I can keep fixing the same hole. Hello. Do you have a second? Ah, long time and no see, Miss Anderson. Tor and Odin are not here. They are uh, old tricksters always sneaking off. Sorry, no, I, I wanted to ask you about something else. Do you live around here? I live in Bright Falls. You have seen me around. I am Mr. Blum. You call me Vladimir. I work at a nursing home. I take care of your old people. We are on day trip, music, sauna, the good times. I bring them here in the bus. The elderly are very important. And it's a very nice bus. Thanks. Can you point me to any trailers around here? Sure. Watery Lighthouse Trailer Park. Ilmo Koskela owns it. He owns many things in town. And where is Ilmo? I saw Ilmo and his brother at the bridge. Well, what used to be the bridge. Hi! Excuse me. Do you know that way? Auntie's in the middle of a show. I wonder if I'm the first FBI agent to ever get shushed. Okay, then. Catchy tune.
Hello. The flooding is even worse here. More like underwatery. I'll have to tell Casey that one later. A trailer park. Ilmo Koskela. He's that tour guide we met at Cauldron Lake. I need to find him. Mom's family was from Sweden. I've always imagined it kind of like this. Saunas, lakes. Seems nice. Enjoying the sauna? You bet. The steam is amazing on my creaky old joints. I'm just waiting for Ati to wrap up his show so we can crack open some beers. I've read that taking a sauna is good for preventing dementia. Yeah, and so is beer. Ever heard of the cult of the tree? The half-deer, half-man monsters? Oh, sure I've heard of them. They're the reason I can't risk taking walks in the forest anymore. If one of them shows up, how am I supposed to get away? I can't run with a bad hip. I'd be killed for sure. I could maybe use my crutches to defend myself. Did you think that'd work? You're the professional. Probably smart just to stay in the sauna for now. Hey, Sarah, a sauna doesn't fix what ails ya. You're a goner. They also say silence is golden. Have you heard old Pat's radio show lately? Yeah, I, I, I fear he's losing his grip on reality. I don't care to listen to pointless jibber-jabber. Not on the radio, not in the sauna. Hey, Saga! Over here! Hey, Ilmo. How did your walk in the woods with Steven go? Another satisfied customer. I just hope he remembers to write a good review on the webpage. Great to see you back in Watery, Saga. Everyone in town missed you. <laughs> Super nice to see you again, Saga. They act like they've known me for years. This keeps happening. Are you familiar with the cult of the tree? Yeah, we always thought it was an urban legend. Kids drawing creepy symbols to scare each other, but, uh... Now it's gotten pretty damn real, huh? It's terrible what happened. We're all in shock. Well, we're looking into it. Hoping to get things back to normal soon. We're all for that. <laughs> as normal as it ever gets around here. You own the trailer park, right? Mind if I take a look inside? 
Um, uh, yeah, I'm pretty sure the owner of the Watery Lighthouse Trailer Park, me, can help you with that. It's good to have our funniest resident back. Resident? I don't understand what you mean. If this is your way of getting out of any outstanding bills, don't worry. They've been handled. Must be hard coming back to where you and your little girl lived. It's like they remember a different reality. Is the horror story messing with their memories? So what is Coffee World? <laughs> you mean you haven't seen our commercial for it? Coffee World is a smooth blend of rides, food, and fun. We even had a real moose. Until recently. Plus, right next to Coffee World is the workshop of our own Kalevala Knights Motorcycle Club. We're busy building the uh, floats for Deerfest. Don't go peeking, though. <laughs> you know, we're saving the big reveal for Deerfest. So, your commercials? They're more than commercials, Saga. Our goal is to both entertain and educate local viewers about the fine products and services we provide. And, uh, Yako here really comes alive in front of the camera. Really. Fuck off. I'm just there for the free beer. Not sure what Ilmo's excuse is. Hey, I'm writer, producer, co-lead, director. Do yourself a favor and, uh, check them all out. I should make sure I've gotten everything out of profiling. Elmo thinks the cult is just an urban legend. Or does he? There are things that go bump in the night. It's all true. It's all true. Sound the alarm, brother. Gather the troops, brother. Yako, the shadow of the forest is creeping closer. They don't think it's an urban legend at all. They understand it's dangerous. Ilmo made it sound like I lived here. Does he really believe that? Light, laughter, and love will guide you home. Saga and her daughter. Oh boy. Happy faces raise property value. Family comes first, Ilmo. We take care of her trailer while she's gone. She's one of us, Yako. Her spare key is safe and sound. The Koskala brothers have happy memories of me living here. This must be the story affecting them. I'll play along for now. I need the key to that trailer. All joking aside, yes, I would like to see my trailer. Do you have a spare set of keys? Good for you. Yeah, I have a spare set. They're just over at Coffee World. I'd get them for you, but Yaku and I have to head to Bright Falls. The spare keys are in the gift shop safe. I'll call ahead and uh, have someone get them out for you. Oh, the road's flooded. But if you just follow this trail behind me, it'll lead you there. Call the gift shop so they can give Saga a hand. Yep. There's Coffee World. Need to get across the river.
crossing on. More people turning into Taken. Is this the cult? Or the story? Or both? Another one of those rhymes. Keep trying. Nope. No. Doesn't make sense. Ugh. Something feels different. I should look around. Oh shit. Cult is leaving supplies around for themselves. Saga was beginning to see why Casey disliked the woods so much. They felt oppressive here. Too many places to hide. The distorted carnival music drifting from the amusement park ahead did not help. What the Koskalis had said about her living in Watery with Logan unsettled her. For the horror story to involve her was one thing, but involving her daughter was crossing a line. 
Something darted across the path ahead. Too fast to see. Saga drew a weapon. Her eyes searched the woods. A noise overhead. Saga swiveled to look. A local. A man on the ridge above her. No. Not a man. A monster with a hatchet in each hand. It shouted down at her. Hunting season was a bust! Another one of those lunch boxes.
Hello? Anyone here? Nope. Did they get out? Did the Taken get them? Or were they turned into Taken? I'll need to get the key to the trailer park myself. Ilmo said the key is kept in the gift shop safe. A list of maintenance work. A screwdriver. Huh. Another locked box.
<laughs> Jesus! <laughs> Calm down, Saga. It's just a pot of coffee. <laughs> Have a beautiful day! When you ask, Maris said a little scared. Overcome! Locked. Okay. What would Ilmo use for a code?
The keys to my trailer. Now to find the clicker and the cult. The page said I'd run into a cultist here. Anyucho Saga. Mercedes is not afraid of the rough questions. myself. Don't know how to fight it. We're too old. Excuse me. I'm looking for the Anderson trailer. What? Sweetie pie, right on time. Like we were just saying, it's not true. The lies to hurt you and make you weak. Don't believe a word. They believe because deep down, they want to be told what to think. We're different. Rebels! You must stop it before it turns real. Don't be part of the story. Make the story. <laughs> stop the hell of it! <laughs> These old drunks don't seem affected by the horror story like the other locals are. Do they know what's happening here? How do you know about the story? Same as you, of course, sweetie pie. We are family. The Andersons. Vikings. Gods. It's so good. To finally see you, Saga. I am your great uncle Odin, and this is your long lost Murfar, Tor. Sarasoka. He is your grandfather, and I am the old father. <laughs> Just as crazy as everyone else. 
just as caught in it. I need to stay focused. I need to check out the trailer. You have things to do, sweetie pie. We don't want to keep you from your business. You can come see us anytime at our refuge. Another Alex Casey lunchbox? is almost here, which means we're <laughs> chopping the prices on all of our custom-designed Deerfest parade floats. Floats created by the award-winning team at Kalevala Knights Motorcycle Club, winners of last year's trophy for best Deerfest float featuring an animal that is not deer. That very team. And you're gonna get a kick <laughs> out of our latest float designs. <laughs> We've done it all. Deerfest floats, restaurant floats, floats shaped like things we can't show on television. Our floats are the best way to impress your friends, propose to your partner, or throw shade at an office colleague. And we don't do just Deerfest. Our floats are a perfect gift for weddings, birthdays, or mitzvahs, or your Gunnasurkinaria. Our floats will punch up any special occasion. <laughs> but why take our word for it? Let's hear it from one of our many, many happy customers. I was at Deerfest last year. Flows you were a handsome again. deer. One of them was a swan. And that was stuff. People liked it. And there you have it. Award-winning floats now at reduced prices that will... <laughs> Duck your filthy <laughs> Order yours today. socks off. Davis family beef jerky will now be available at the Sunday market in three delicious flavors. That's right. Our favorite sponsor, Davis family beef jerky, can now be enjoyed in smoked hickory, teriyaki, and hickory teriyaki. Reeks of booze. Ah, we got time. Addressed to me from years ago. Wake was right. The horror story is changing reality, not just people's memories. This card has mom's handwriting. Yep, 
Already got the answers to these. Shouldn't spend time on old questions. Wakes says a story will change reality around us. If that's true, then I need to know what's real and what's fiction. sure the owner of the watery lighthouse trailer park me can help you with that it's good to have our funniest resident back okay okay she drowned your daughter that's so weird you don't remember. Doesn't look right. Saga had lost count of how many shots she'd fired, but she was sure it must have been more than she had in her magazine. And yet, she'd not run out of ammo, as if the magazine had grown to fit more bullets. She fired again.
If only the rest of the Bureau knew what a softy Casey is. I need to open the safe. What's the combination? People hate the puzzle, Zuma. Why not just use keys? People love the puzzles, Yaku. Only very smart people can think up good puzzles. Just look around and you will find the answer. Dedicated staff will be rewarded. The combination to the safe is somewhere in the gift shop. Everything here reminds me of Logan. My newfound relatives. Cozy with the cult of the tree. And that's the clicker. In the hands of the cult, just like the page promised. Carlyvala Knights. That's the motorcycle club the Coskella brothers are in. I'll take Odin and Tor up on their offer and visit their nursing home. Right after I find this biker workshop. No. It's, it's not true. It's just a fucking story. It's not true. Logan's back home. She's fine. Fuck. She's at school. David. story and it's coming true. Wake said Scratch would try and hurt me with the horror story. But he said there's still time to stop this. That he can stop this with a clicker. Hey, this is David. Leave a message. David? Is Logan okay? Call me back as soon... Mulligan is a cultist? What the fuck is going on here? The cult of the tree! Thornton too? God damn it! And now they're all taken?
Such a shame. Locked. They must be in there. There has to be a way to get this lock open. This is the cult's hideout. Their headquarters, even? The cult isn't well organized. People aren't following orders. The Nightingale ritual wasn't completed. The cult is leaving supplies around for themselves. This is the cult's process. Their ritual. This will be handy. That's it. Shouldn't spend time on old questions. Just look around and you will find the... Mulligan and Thornton have the clicker. It's in another overlap. Here in Watery. Right. Hmm. No, Logan's not dead.
Rose. She's that waitress from the diner. This is one weird cult. Creepy basement. playing with me. I was so close. The clicker was there the whole time. Fucking Mulligan and Thornton. No. Mulligan and Thornton are members of the cult. Leader. Brains leaking out like ilk. The thrill of domination. Not one tree. A forest. The word. A secret like this doesn't die. There is more than one leader. Sorry, we're at a Bright Falls blend, Anna apologized to the customers. I'll just grab some from the back. More coffee coming right up. She suggested they ride the percolator while they waited. She passed Ilmo at the Espresso Express. Big smile, Anna. Coffee world is all smiles. Anna nodded, smiled. She smiled until her face hurt. Anna stopped walking, realized she was standing next to the Huatari well. Must have zoned out, she thought. She was about to go, but something in the well caught her eye. A shadow shifting in the dark. Anna was overcome by vertigo. The world tilted, and then she was falling down, down, down into the shaft. The darkness opened up to swallow her. They took the clicker into the overlap. How do I get it back? There was
There was another overlap here in Watery. The parade float was the key. Mulligan and Thornton had gone there, taken the clicker, left this monster here to stop her. There's an overlap here, like there was at Cauldron Lake. Mulligan and Thornton are like Nightingale. Inside, waiting. And a parade float is the key. Saga had read about it. The trap. She knew what was waiting for her. The moment she saw the giant, she knew she wasn't ready. You let Logan drown. The weapon it carried could crack her skull like a brittle egg. Brains leaking out like yolk. Everything she loved, lost. Everything she was, lost. We will watch it eat your mind. Reading this made her sick. But the fear was sharp when she faced it. There was another overlap here in Watery. The parade float was the key. Mulligan and Thornton had gone there, taken the clicker with them, left this monster here to stop her. Mulligan and Thornton were fine earlier. How did this happen? A terrible mistake. Shadows crept over Mulligan and Thornton. Shadows on their faces, filling the shape of them. Bright Falls fucking finest. Shitty pastrami sandwich. Mulligan and Thornton became like Nightingale. Taken is upstairs. This was a trap. A fuse could come in handy. <laughs> 